Hi everyone, here's another update on the build of the laser harp. Uh, this time I've made an ILDA version. Uh, the mainboard is exactly the same, it's just instead of routing the signal to a, directly to a galvanometer in a standalone version, uh, I've routed it to uh, an ILDA connection, which connects to this standard, probably Chinese laser projector. It is a 550 milliwatt RGB laser. Here is the sensor array of the harp. So currently the harp is transmitting the information on MIDI channel 1 using bank 1 and the standard octave. So now it's using octave 4. So the harp is connected to this um, Roland D50 synthesizer. It's an old machine, but it uh, still works pretty well. So I'm quite happy with it. Anyway, let's switch off the light and see what happens. So when I press the start button, The harp will emit a single single beam, and I have here this just piece of paper just to mimic my hands in the beams. So when I touch the beam, the beam fan opens. So I have programmed uh, the harp to uh, send out white uh, color at this moment, just for demonstration purposes. So when I now put my hand in the beam. it plays the notes uh, through the synthesizer. So because the harp is ILDA and it supports multicolor, so you can program um, each ray individual. Now I hope you can see this, I'll put some smoke in the beams. And it still works the same as with the harp. So because the harp is sending out MIDI signals, so the sound you from you hear depends on the synthesizer. So if I use a different patch on the Roland, <coughs> I'll move up one octave here then the sound is completely different. Put down one octave. Recognize this sound from Jean-Michel Jarre's uh, album Revolution. So when I touch or when I press the start stop button again, the beam fan will close until a single beam, and then again, when I touch the beam, it will the laser will switch off. Okay, thanks for watching.